On this episode of ABCD, our special guest today is Dr. Vicki Golick. Vicki has been working in higher education for many years. She has been working at MSU Denver since 2009 as the Provost and Executive Vice President for Academic and Student Affairs. Knowing that Vicki has the world's greatest laugh, I'm very much looking forward to driving around with her today. Tell me about your freshman year, which I which I learned because I did a little research on you was in 1968. <laughs> is that true? It is true. Yeah. yeah. And where did you go to college? I went to Occidental College. Occidental College. Yes, yeah, I read that too. College in near Los Angeles. My grandma wouldn't, wanted me to go to Occidental College so bad. Really? Yeah, she lives in Pasadena. Oh. Um, and she was like, I want you to go to Occidental. And I was like, you just want me to go to come back to California. That's right. right. <laughs> what did you go in as wanting to major in? So I went in and graduated in the same thing. Oh, you did? Yes, which is Diplomacy and World Affairs. Amazing. Isn't that a weird title? It is um, a weird title. Can you break that down? Can yes. you break that down for us? <laughs> so it's really basically an international relations. Okay. And I saw that you studied abroad. Yes. Your junior year. Mm -hmm. Where did you go? I studied in Germany. Germany. Um, Is that how you say it? Mm -hmm. I was like, S -s 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 there was a lot of like, <laughs> yes. it was it was spelled interesting. Yeah. How long were you there? So I was. I w okay. So I have to back up just a little. Yeah, bit back it up. In order to explain. This. So I was really lucky. Um, when I was a junior in high school, uh -huh. I was an American Field Service foreign exchange student. Oh, okay. Brazil. So I was in Brazil for uh, three months in the summer, which was awesome. Uh -huh. And um, I had studied Spanish from the time I was in seventh grade. So I was pretty good in Spanish. Uh -huh. Portuguese is very similar. Yes. Mm -hmm. My family couldn't speak English very well, so it was easier for me to speak Portuguese. I'll pick up the Portuguese. Mm -hmm. So I came back. Yes. Um, speaking pretty darn good Portuguese. And nice. I tried to continue my Spanish lessons. And then you were like, right. and it wasn't happening? Mixed the words mixed up. So oh, okay. So when I went to college, I decided that I would take a completely different language, which was oh, German. Oh, nice. So then they just started this study abroad program in Germany, and that's sort of why I ended up going to Germany. Okay, okay. Were yep. you, are you Victoria or are no. you Vicky? I'm Vicky. You're just strictly Vicky. Vi strictly yeah. Vicky. Strictly <laughs> That's going to be my nickname that I give you. <laughs> I gave Steve Kreidler a nickname of Special K. So if I you like want to, you want to call him Special K, you're, feel free to do so. Okay. Um. Oh, okay. So I invented a game for you. Okay. Are you, are you scared? I don't. I don't think I'm scared. <laughs> Should I be scared? No. <laughs> it. It is called. Are you ready? Sure. It's called Vicky. Is, is that, that you? you? Oh dear. <laughs> Vicky, is that you? I Google image searched your whole name. And a lot of interesting photos came up. Okay. And so I printed some of them out. Okay. And you're gonna let me know. Vicky, is that you? Is that me? Okay, okay you ready? <laughs> Vicky, is that you? Not exactly. Vicky, is that you? <laughs> no. 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 Uh, but it is Metro State. It Isn't is that Metro fun? State, I like that. Vicky, is that you? That is me. Yeah. This one came That's up. That's a younger one. Vicky, is that you? <laughs> no, but that is my very close friend and colleague. Dr. Haynes. Thank you for playing Vicky, is that you? <laughs> You're very welcome. So I made you a playlist. Oh, okay. Let's 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 hear the, <laughs> it's a it's the top top one hundred, Billboard Top One Hundred. Oh, okay. Um and the first song on it. Hey Jude, don't make it bad. It's the Beatles Hey Jude. There you Take go. Yeah. I will Bay. Yeah. Yep. No little Otis. Um, what else is on here? There's creams on here. Cream, yeah. Yeah. Is this the stuff you? Is yeah. this the? Is oh, this yeah. the jams you listen oh, yeah. to? Did you go to like concerts and stuff? What was your? What was your fun thing you like to do? I did a whole lot of concerts. Um, so I, I worked while I was in college. Oh. Uh -huh. um, I was. It's I getting me a dog. 
Cadet or a worse one. It's a space cadet. Space cadet? <gasps> you didn't! That's like one of my dream, like, you know when you can pick like like dream jobs just just in case like you want to just redo your life and have like a midlife crisis or something? Disneyland is one of them. Yes. I want to be a Disney, were you, but you, so you weren't a Disney princess because you worked in Tomorrowland. No, I was not a Did you get to wear like a space suit and stuff? <laughs> What was your outfit for Tomorrowland? Um, so I actually worked for the telephone company uh -huh. at America the Beautiful, which is an exhibit that is no longer there. America the Beautiful. But America the Beautiful was a, a, an auditorium and it had a 360 movie, uh -huh. a 360 movie theater. Uh -huh. club, um, and then they drove around in cars like this or on a fire truck or you know, through a herd of buffalo or whatever. Yeah. But it just showed you America. Oh, so okay. That was very cool. Um, and we had, we had, because it was mini skirt era. So oh. we had little mini skirts and boots and, and it was full top. But the thing that was really weird about working here, uh -huh. we had to wear red lipstick. Red lipstick? This was the era of white lipstick. Oh! We were wearing red lipstick. I didn't know there was a white lipstick era. Um, okay, so we have this book in our office that we gave out this year. Have you seen this? No. It's called The A Game, Nine Steps to Better Green. Five is get spaced out. Oh, see, it's perfect. I was a space cadet. You were a space cadet. <laughs> so five is all about time management. Oh, God. Um, <laughs> when I'm super passionate about, because I feel like a lot of our freshmen, that's the biggest, that's the hardest oh, it's very hard. thing for them. So let's talk about time management. I had, I always walked around with my sort of day book. Yeah. Calendar with, you know, from here to here I do this, from here to here I do that. Yeah. So mm -hmm. What I try to do is limit myself to a certain amount of time to get a certain thing done. Yeah. I'm not always really good about getting the thing done. Okay. In that time frame. Yeah. I tend to be a perfectionist, which is a Ooh. disease I'm trying to get over. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> I feel like I'm that, I'm that way too. I want it to be like perfect. Yeah. yeah. Well, I think that if the appearance is good, people will pay attention to the content. If the appearance is bad, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. Anyway, so, um, but I think, yeah, time management is really, really important. And so you've got to give yourself time off. Uh huh. And time to play. You gotta do some self care. Yes, self care. Uh huh. In order to also keep yourself on task to get the work done. That's a really good advice. <laughs> I have I have rapid fire questions. Oh, okay. Okay, you ready? Here we go. What's your favorite movie? Oh, Shawshank Redemption. What foods do you hate? Okra. Um, can you do any celebrity impressions? No. <laughs> what makes you laugh the most? Oh my gosh. I laugh a lot. You do laugh. You have a great laugh. Oh, thank you. Everybody who was, I was told about the series, I'm like, you like you so you were born there? Yes, I was born on a military base hospital in England. Okay. Lake and Heath Hospital. Yep. Um what's going on there? Eh? Good call. That's what yeah. you're <laughs> 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 Sorry, that's new to the route. My new bad. to the route? I'm like, where are we going? <laughs>